hide from eruption. I'm trying. Uh, I obviously haven't got the car keys. That's a siren going off. Yeah, that's a that's a good sound. Uh, 500 meters in a minute. What's that? Is that? I mean, that's not world record pace or anything, is it? I mean, that's uh, that's only moderate. What would that make it? Two minutes for a for a kilometer. No, no, no. The four-minute mile was done ages ago. Many people have run a four-minute mile since then, and that's 1,600 metres in four minutes. Right, which means you're doing 400 metres a minute. Oh, I should get there with time to spare, he said, looking at the timer and, uh, and the distance he still has to travel and the terrain on which he's travelling. Yeah, I'm doomed. Yeah, this is, uh, this is not going to go well. We're going to try and go as the crow flies. Uh, it might kill me, but uh, frankly, it's not going to kill me as much as the volcano that is shortly going to erupt will do. 20 seconds. It's all sounding quite exciting now. Uh, 15. Yeah, okay, good. Still still 170 metres to go. I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. I think this might be the end of times. Uh, we'll have a look over there. No, it seems, that seems to be dormant. Um, I'm pretty certain I'm going to make it. There we go. And totally safe. Whoa! Not totally safe. Right, that's gone off. I might be able to get in ahead of the pyroclastic flow that will be arriving. Oh, crumbs. Uh, presently. And, oh, dearie me. You have lost the game. Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Vulcanoids. I'm a Vulcanoid, you're a Vulcanoid, he, she, we, they are Vulcanoids. Uh, yes, I'm on board, uh, I don't know, something, and uh, and I believe I need to go and speak to Captain Birdseye to figure out exactly what's going on. Oh, he's, he's there, look. He's, uh, yo, Birdseye, you, uh, you having a good time or what? No, he's, he's asleep. Uh, evidently, it doesn't want to tell me anything. Presumably because I told it to turn the tutorial off. Anyway, my first objective here is to go and uh, hijack myself a, uh, a drill ship before the volcano, uh, which you can see over yonder mountainside there, uh, before that gets all rowdy and, uh, and causes us untold trouble. Uh, but uh, because, uh, because this is that kind of adventure, I am going to harvest a little bit of good stuff. All the way there. Uh, hold on. Eat this, you robot. Oh, come on, face plate. There you go. Uh, yes, the, the, these robot chaps, they are, they're really up to no good at all. They are entirely responsible for all of this behaviour. Oh, hello, he's got a friend. Get get off me. I'm, I'm using the tried and tested uh, stand and fire uh, approach to combat, uh, which, is, uh, which is deadly effective. Now then, I need... To, uh, to go and get myself a, uh, a drill ship. We'll see if we can't hijack this one. I don't know if we can or not, because I've disabled the tutorial, and the tail end of the tutorial has you nicking a drill ship at the end of it. Um, but I'm not certain if that's, if that's how we're to do it here. Anyway, peekaboo, anyone? No? All right, we'll let ourselves in. I'm sure it'll be fine. Uh, I've got pickaxe, we'll travel. And uh, we're going. What? Who's that? Eat this. Yeah, and you. Right. Okay. Well, that. I mean, that hurt a little bit, but uh, we'll take all of their good stuff anyway. A couple of shotgun shells is uh, is absolutely dandy. Although a revolver ammo is more my speed. Right. Here we go. Come on. Let me in. Let me in. I want to come in, please. Open the door. Oh, the other door was open. Ah, details. Right then, how do I steal this ship? I mean, I can I can just steal the items from the ship. Let's uh, let's go into the let's go into the menu here uh, and into the storage, and let's just liberate all of this lot. Yeah, yeah, because uh, their former owners don't need it anymore. That's for sure. Right, good. Uh, stealing the stealing the storage. I'll show you how all that works once uh, once I'm at safety. But as you can see, possibly at the top of the screen there. Oh what? Oh flipping heck, there's more of them. Alright. Don't crumbs. Don't know. You don't want to take a Alright, I'm off, lads. No, 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 no. It's been real. Uh but uh no, I'm uh, I'm legging it. Hang on. And cop this you metal git. Gimme all of this stuff and then start running again. 
There you go. Put some bullets in the gun. Put some bullets in the gun. Alright, now then. Drill ship, 180 metres away. Let's go get it. Uh, apparently it's only surfacing now. How jolly convenient. It's almost like they knew I was going to be in need of a drill ship. Right, here we go. We've got to watch out for survivors, apparently. Because uh, the little robot fellas that inhabit these things, they're the ones that are causing all of the volcano action uh, that is the, the whole reason for our existence in this strange and wondrous land. Uh, there you go, there's one. Let's, uh, let's pop, him in the, pop him into something when he stops doing the hokey cokey. Alright! Kaboosh! Yeah, die in, die under the hail of bullets. Right, there you go. Hail of bullets. I'll take his head while we're at it. Uh, because uh, we'll be able to research that and potentially learn the mysticisms of the ancient arts of tea making. Uh, right, here we go. Here's our ship. Here's your first look at it. Yeah, it is a bit banged up. You're not wrong. Uh, th these holes, particularly, are, uh, are not, not ideal. Uh, right, okay. So, what we've got here is we've got the speakerphone. Uh, we've got the driving chair, which is brand new for this update. Which is jolly exciting. Uh, we've got storage, which we shall sling all of our uh, all of our bonus pieces into. That's all good. Right, okay. Drill, walk up to the drill. Walk into the drill ship. I have done. Uh, the core slot is the rounded object in the wall. Rounded object in the wall. Rounded object. Rounded object. Maybe it's upstairs. Rounded object in the wall. Where are you? Are you very tall? Guess not. Nope, not seeing it. Uh, we'll turn the power off. No, I don't own it yet. It's not going to allow me to turn the power off until I own the beast. Oh, that's a rounded object. There we go. Right. This is now my, uh, my own personal spaceship for my own personal usage. And it's broken. So we're going to try and fix some of that. Well, uh, I've got no item available. Sure, I thought I had some on me still. I got some module repair kits. Yeah, you need a whole breach kit. Oh, okay, right. We'll go to the production station, and uh, we'll uh, we'll sort out some breach repair kits. Copper plot bolts, copper plates. You mean that stuff that I just put into storage? Well, why can't I access? Oh, because you didn't put them into storage. You're carrying them about your person. Right. Put all of this lot into storage. Yeah, and that and this. Good. You might as well have the sulfur as well and this crash helmet. Right. And then we shall go back to the production station. Actually, we'll go to the refinery first and we'll tell it to craft up some more ingots. And yeah, 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 yep. Yeah. Oh, I've got to, I've got to build or deploy that. Uh, get the furnace online. Look, we got five minutes to make this uh, this ship operational. There you go. Get uh, get working. Make as many as you can. And, uh, and actually, before we do the, any more... No, no, let's get it ship shape and then we'll duck and cover. Uh, we need a module repair kit. Copper bolts, copper plates. But I've got some in storage. Or have I? Plates, bolts. I've got some in storage. Module repair kit. We'll keep hold of that. But... Yes, breach replacement. Oh, we, we don't actually want a module repair kit. We want a be breach fixer. Uh, right, okay, let's uh, let's fix these breaches. Fix that. What do you mean there's no item available? Oh, hold on. Well, no, wait. I need the breaching kit. Yeah. Oh, the witch is in storage. Oh, flip it. Gimme, I've, I've got six of them now. <laughs> right, okay. Way to use all your resources there, dude. Excellent work. Yeah, yeah. Bang that one in. Yeah, and that. Hold on, that was the door. Well, it's just going to make getting in and out a bit tricky for the time bit. It's not. It's that's that's a bit of an error in judgment. I'm honest. Uh, you're going to want to you're going to want to take that back out again. Maybe I want to put the door somewhere else. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. There we go. See, everybody, be happy. Call call yourselves. Uh, that's good. Yeah, we'll have all of this. Thank you. Right. So you've got no material. We need a door. Uh, module equipped structure. Door. 
Yeah, see, that's, that's going to be significantly more useful to us in the upcoming flea from pyroclastic doom. So, uh, so there is a volcano about to go off and I'm in the process of doing a bit of remodeling of my ship. Uh, I'm pretty sure we'll be all right as long as I, uh, as long as I get us underground in, in good time. We'll stick that in there. Oh, you've got to replace the breach for, oh, okay. Right, stick that, stick a hatch on that. Good, we are golden. Uh, right, let's get into the operation seat here and uh, head underground. We want to go tunnels one. Go underground, please. There we go. Right, we are drilling to safety and uh, and potential victory afterwards. There are still a couple of banged up bits of uh, bits of drill ship there, so we'll have to we'll have to fix those off when everything is peachy again. Now, once we're underground, we can uh, we can look topside and uh, and examine the marvelous destructive forces of nature uh, as uh, as trouble is going on. So here we go. We're top site another lovely city there and uh, there's there's mother nature waiting to uh, to unfurl her skirts with the uh, the bounteous goodness of a magma based release and uh, just that oh there she blows and that's lovely that's why we don't want to be topside uh, it's also possibly why you don't really want to be sticking a periscope up there but i'm gonna chance it there we go. I see. It's all. It's all fine. It's all. It's all fine. Everything is. Everything is now peachy. Uh, the world is as we all remember it to be. Um, a glorious. Uh, a glorious wreck of a place. And that's. That all looks jolly positive. Yeah. Anyway, we've won the game. Uh, congratulations to us. Now then. Uh, what we don't, what I don't understand at the moment is how I actually travel from here. Because this new update to the game introduces the ability to actually drive your, uh, drive your ship around. Uh, maybe I don't have that luxury yet. Oh, hello! Yes, I do. Right, what's that? Hull? Yeah, temperature. Interesting. Uh, five times copper ore. Yeah, no, well, we'll have that. Oh, this is fun. Okay, because usually you do uh, you do quite a lot of your uh, resource gathering while you're topside in between explosions. Uh, but, uh, but this is this is interesting. Uh, no, we'll keep going. Right, that's uh, some more copper. That's good. Well, it saves me having to dig it up. No, I mean this is <laughs> as interfaces go. It's a little rough and ready, uh, but the the functionality is rather splendid. Now then, I want to get up top. Oh, hold everything. What's over there? Yes, no, I need those. Those are the... Hold on, what are you? Oh, that's an enemy ship. I don't really want to tangle with that just yet. Uh, right, surface. Surface, surface. Surface. Uh, can we... Surface, please. Up top. Up we go. I suppose it's that. Oh, ah, 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 it is. There are designated. That's a designated surfacing zone. Right. Well, we'll go there. Come on, there, tiny. Let's uh, let's rumble. No, I have to. Do I have to do it? Yeah, yes, we do. We're going over here. All right. So I've been on a little bit of a raid, uh, but now everything's everything's good. In fact, I'm I'm trying to avoid all this rock-based stuff. But do I need to? Evidently, I do. We're going we're going topside. Everybody, that brace. And, and things. There we go. Up we go. Hold on to something. Uh, there will be some minor disruption. And uh, and as you can see, everything up top is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, we've got uh, 18 of your finest minutes there in which to uh, do as much as humanly possible. Right. Everything is currently deployed. Where's my, uh, where's my status bar? Uh, actually, while I'm about it, I want to... Uh, you let's get rid of that. Although I used the wrong button there, I could have just dismantled it. Um, probably destroyed it instead. But, uh, but that's okay. I've got another one. That was why I was removing it in the first place. Uh, what else have we got in here? We've got storage, which is almost full already. A workbench. We've got another one of these that's telling me what my uh, what my power situation is. And currently we have a, a one uh, a one power unit surplus 
which is good because that means we can run absolutely everything. Right, jolly good. Now then, uh, down please. Thank you. Uh, we shall get into the menu over here. Uh, drop all of this into. No, 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 that is the storage thing. The storage thing is just not very big at the moment. Uh, we'll put the module repair kit in there as well. And then we'll, uh, well, I suppose we'll get crafting. Uh, components? No. No, you, it's the refinery is what you want. You want to refine all of that stuff into things. Oh, yes, so I do. Right. Make as many of these as you could, as you feel like making. Right, then get outside and uh, and go go find what you need. Well, I don't know what I need. What I, what I need, first of all, is we want another, another storage bin, which is going to require plates and a chest. Okay, fine. Uh, let's go chest. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you. And then, uh, and then we need some plates. All right, uh, we'll have a couple of those. Because it's not like we're not going to get through them. And then we can build ourselves a storage module. No, we can't. Why not? Because you also need pipes. Uh, Alright, I've built some. There you go. Right, now, we can also have a sucking coal plant, which is good, but we don't need it yet. Uh, the turret module is is fine. I mean, it's it's well worth having, uh, but it's, it's going to be more useful once... Uh, uh, once I, once I've actually got the power to support it, which I don't at the moment. Now then, we don't need any of the structural stuff. We don't need any of that. What I really want is to double the length of my uh, of my ship. But I'm not. I don't think I'm there yet. Drill ship core. Drill ship segment. Yes. I'll take one, please. Right. Okay. That's going to add part two, which will mean that we're going to have plenty of space in which to do stuff. Right, okay, it's time to be ducking down again for the uh, for the next eruption, so we'll uh, uh, we'll just rip the ripcord there and uh, and duck it down. Ship folds up, marvelous. Uh, so that's basically all your operational modules like to stick themselves away at night uh, before you go down. I mean, otherwise you're going to bend your chimney and all kinds of all kinds of behaviour. Now we're getting underground with plenty of time because I actually need to do uh, a couple of uh, a couple of upgrades while we're down here. So we'll just wait till we level off. Uh, but you can only add a new segment to your ship while you are beneath the surface. Uh, so we'll do that now. Uh, where's the... Uh, there you go. Bang that in there. There we go. Right, we now have we now have doubled the distance. As you can see, we can, uh, we can now f fling ourselves all the way to the back of the ship. We're, we're double length. Uh, and I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to use this for storage. Uh, we've got a second power plant, which I'll probably put online as well, uh, because, uh, well, that, that would that would be sensible. Um, because I'm going to stick a turret up too. Uh, can we uh, can I remove my storage? My, my front storage there? No. Interesting. This online storage here does not appear to be connected to the rest of the online. Oh, unless the online storage is currently offline, because I'm underground. Of course it is. That's 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 exactly what's going on. I can't do much of anything while I'm underground, uh, unless I can. Can we? Uh, can we? Can we move this? Yes, we can. Beautiful. Right. Good. So why can't I? Why? Why are you refusing to uh, to play ball? Maybe your automatic, guaranteed storage there. Uh, that's that's certainly plausible. Anyway, I'm going to put all of this stuff up near the back because uh, we don't need it up front at the moment. Uh, right, what are you? Your storage. Yeah, I'm going to need lots of that, so we'll put two of those in there. That's a turret module which I want up front. And then we'll put our uh, uh, the factory here and we'll stick. No, I want the, uh, the production. Uh, the foundry and the factory right next to each other. Good. Now, that's, I mean, it's unprotected, sat back here, which is a bit of a, a, bit of a drag, but uh, it's, uh, it's not a deal breaker. Uh, and then we'll stick our second uh, power plant, which I left in the online storage. Oh, fooey. Okay, fine. Essential devices are missing. I've I've done it. I have built production thing. No, I haven't built it. Uh, I've done. I forgot to build it. Where are we going? Back here. Right. So what did I place? That's a factory. That's that is production. Uh, what are you? Oh, your production. What's the factory? That's the that's the power plant, Yanana. Uh, you want that on the roof? There you go. Uh, that one. 
There you go. Switch everything on, and then we also need to have a look at the power situation. I'm optimistic that I've got enough. Oh yeah, we're at plus four on the power grid. Alright, that's peachy. But then again, I'm not actually making anything at the moment. So, uh, so I mean, that's, that's possibly... Uh... There you go. And have I got it? No, I haven't got it. Why haven't I got it? Remove, remove. There you go. Thank you. Go and stick this one up next to the other ones. Like that. Smashing. Right, and then we can see what's stored in what. So you can see we've got five in that, we've got none in that, we've got none in... Where's everything else gone then? Is it in the one at the front of the ship that I seem to be unable to... Yeah, what do you know? Okay, well I guess I guess we'll, we'll just live with that then. Right, so what we're looking to build here, if we go in, is uh, another module, which is the re, uh, the re uh, search. Yes, we need a converter. Okay, that's a robot bit. We'll have to go and find that. Let's pull up this uh, little party favour. Fling it over there. Cooey! I'm here for your stuff! I find that robots... Oh, hello! What's that? Oh, flipping it, they got a gun turret. Okay, that I had not anticipated. Uh, that's also a gun turret. No, it's not. No, no, they only have one. Foolish! Should have put one on both sides. Right, what are they, what do you got? Uh, definitely want that. Oh, oh, hang on. It's showtime. It's showtime. Yeah, all right. Hello. Three. Look, I used grenades to flush you people out. It's going to be close. Use this while you still can. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Thank you. Right. Get that. Get what have you got? Scrap metal. I'll take it. Uh, actually, health kit. I'll take that too. Uh, you? What are you packing? Bullets. Thank you. Door-to-door uh, -door bullet delivery. Always welcome. Yeah, a bit of sulfur. Yeah. Uh, explore, explore ahead. Don't want the sulfur. Thank you. I'll take the explore ahead. Right. What have you got in here? Storage. We want the pump. We want the shredder. Uh, the storage module we're just going to have to leave behind. A converter. Oh, beautiful. All uh, right, this is all very good news. Anything else that we can carry? Yeah. Okay. Let's go check the chest. How long have I got? Eight minutes. Okay. All right. It's okay. We've got plenty of time at the moment. Uh, just as long as we don't get killed. Uh, what about this one? More scrap, more bullets. Do we want to sacrifice something to keep the bullets? Yeah, we'll leave the win we'll leave this window behind. There you go. Have a window, chaps. Hope you like it. Uh, right, good. Are we done here? We're done here. Let's run away and, uh, and make our way back. Just let's let's run away. Oh no! Oh, this is this is rather unfortunate. If I can't get these clowns out of my face, come on, get out of the way. Get out of oh, wait. If I can't get out the door. Then we got we got problems. Oh no! <laughs> I can't get out of the, get out of it, you metal git. Oh, tell me tell me I can crouch or something. Right. Okay. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to old school this and uh, we'll attempt to dig our way out. And I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll do this. We'll go. Uh, we'll do some crumbs. No, no, no. Not what. Drop down the hole. Drop. Oh, okay. Ah, that'll do. There we go. Marvellous. Right, well, that was a uh, slightly close call, but uh, we made it out because uh, that was what the universe had planned for us. If I look at it, see, it already looks beefy. And there's my turret prowling for, for robotic miscreants uh, such that uh, it, can, uh, it can drop a train on them when the, uh, when the need arises. Good. There we go. That's uh, in with trot. Close the hatch. Please build sulfur all the times. That would be grand. Right, while you're figuring that out, we'll go to research. And we'll... Uh, so what you... Uh, basically, the way you do is you, you look at the, the upgrade that you want. And you kind of go, oh yes, interesting. I, I see what you need there. Uh, and in this case, if we want to upgrade our research facility, then uh, we want three Intel Research T1 modules. So here... Intel Research T1s. That uses converters, that uses destroyed modules, and that uses explorer heads. 
expensive. Uh, this uses shredders. These guys use pumps and builder heads. Basically, you can only get this stuff by trashing robots. Uh, right, we'll have one of those. And as you can also see, they're not exactly quick to uh, quick to produce. I know we've got a minute and thirty left. We wait for the siren. We we won't be we won't be diving until the siren informs us that we really should be doing it about now. Uh, but it has to be said, there ain't uh, there ain't a massive amount that I can do at the moment. And that's our show, kids. Uh, hold on, hold on. Give me. Uh, I want one more of these. Yeah, one more. I know, I'm, 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 I'm cutting it close. Uh, give me that. It's going to give me something to do during the night. Uh, no, 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 not those. Put that back, grab those, do this, go pull the lever. Uh, which is... Yeah. There we go, pack her up. We're off. Now, I have a suspicion that two is going to be uh, slightly less forgiving than one. And I'm not exactly at the point yet where uh, where I feel confident uh, that uh, the might the devil's stomach. Why not? Of course, devil's stomach sounds delightful. Uh, sounds it certainly sounds safe, and uh, I feel very well equipped to uh, to be able to deal with it. Now, before I actually go topside, I need to. Uh, I'm going to get myself. A, oh, hang on, <clears throat> lost my bearings a bit because we were on the wonk. Uh, let's grab this. Give me some more health kits. Thank you. We might need them. And uh, I'm going to... Oh, dearie me. Ooh, crumbs. Okay. Well, uh, this is this is dangerous looking. Um, right. Good. All right. Let's turn off the research pod. Research pod. Research pod is here. Off. Gun turret on, uh, just in case there are jokers outside, and I suspect there probably are. Power's good. I feel frisky. Let's go see what we've won. Cooey! I'm here. Who flipping wants some? Right. All right, there is a two-star security joint over there. Oh, he's dead. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Sorry for your loss of your life. Oh, it's a bubbly lava look. I wonder how uh, how safe that is for a human armed with a pistol to just stroll nearby. I'm going to guess not particularly safe. Although, uh, meltable robot Johnny over there seems to be okay, so uh, I assume I will be too. I don't know where your chums are, but I imagine they will turn up shortly. Did you have anything good? Got a pump. Alright, well, that's, uh, that's something I can use. And eat my terror. It's a it's a gun. Right, let's uh, let's get in here before they decide to bail out. Obviously, they'll turn up in a minute and go. Oh, hello. And I go. Oh, good evening, copper. Yeah, coal. I'll take the coal. I'll take the converter. We don't want any else. You see that wobbly heat effect there? Yes. What does that suggest to you? Suggest to you that you're going to get cooked if you walk that way. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Alright, well, can we. What if we just do this a bit? Ouch, 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 ouch. No, oh, you're fine, look. There you go, you're worrying about nothing. I'm only worrying about nothing if I can get back to. Oh, he's, going... he's having a go, look. I mean, we should chase him, despite the fact that turrets will probably get him. Watch. Watch from a distance. There you go. Yeah, you see, he's dead now. You have nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about at all. Oh, this is the worst place in the world. I don't want to be here. That's too hot. Yep, that's a gun turret. Okay, yep, 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 yep. Sorry for interrupting. Ten heal, ten heal, ten heal. Hope no, no robots turn up until we're healed. Okay, here we go. And find the door. Alright, there's a door. Here's a door. Alright, spank it. Now, there will be other robots. The big question is, when are they going to jack me? For it will be soon. 
We're in? Okay. Now then. Uh, Bruce bonus first. <gasps> Slugs. Good bullets. Ooh. Coal pot. Flipping with jackpot. Right. Okay, cool. What else? Uh, who are bullets? Yes. Production stone. No, no, no. Yes. Give me that. Give me that. Uh, coal. Yeah, we'll have that. Uh, we'll take them. Anything else? No. Right. Okay, good. Any more for any more. No, no, we, we, we've done well here. Uh, check this one. What do you got? Copper ingots? Yeah, we'll take those. Yeah, okay, good. Sounds so, sounds so dangerous. Right, what do you got in online storage? I think we've already raided it all. Uh, we'll take the bullets. But that's about it. Right, okay, good. Anything else you want to do while you're here? I want to wreck something. Uh, we could wreck the ability to go uh, below ground. Yeah, isn't that just being churlish, though? Yes, it is. Uh, which, where, where's their, where's their grip handle? Grip handle. Yes, the uh, the flipping aiming. T oh, hold on! I'll tell you what we could do. Hang on, that's uh, where is it? There you are. That one. Yeah, yeah. This is what you get. We can't disable it. Ten minutes to go. It's all right. I feel safe. See, if I can break the turret, it will have a tough time shooting at me. That's, uh, that's the logic I want. Broken! How many of these things have they got? These guys are paranoid. Uh, well, <laughs> are they paranoid if you are out to get them? Well, I mean, that's, that's worthy of consideration, certainly. But we, we got some Tier 2 ammo. Uh, whether or not I can use Tier 2 ammo is pretty much irrelevant. I've got it anyway. Brilliant. Uh, obviously, I don't think we can use it at all, but uh, we will be able to use it in the future. Anyway, oh, hang on. Clear off. Uh, anyway, I'm in Colonel Failure, and this is Vulcanoids. And uh, I can't pick up that bit that I'm going to give him that and take his head. There you go. We didn't send him out for coal. What's going on? Uh, yeah, so there you go. Uh, there, there is more, obviously, to this. Uh, as you research, you uh, you get new materials and new upgrade options and all of that kind of jazz uh, that you can investigate. Uh, but uh, but hopefully this gives you a, a taste of the game. And uh, you see, uh, now, that, now that he popped up, I'm, I'm a little concerned that others might have the same idea. Uh, anyway, I've been Curl Fan. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch up with you soon. Uh, game's available on Steam. All of the usual business. I'll talk to you soon. Oh yes, back to this. Cheerio! There you go, Vulcanoids. Uh, Vulcanoids. Vulcanoids. Uh, the, the, the place is called uh, Alcano or something, uh, but they, they, they pronounced it in a very weird place. This is in the fluff of the game. It's called Al Alcano. Or, uh, Alcanos. That's it. But they pronounce it Alcanos. No, uh, Volcano. Yeah, and they, they pronounce it Alcanos uh, so that it rhymes with Volcano on Alcanos or something like that. And I thought, uh, that's some, that's some high-quality fluff right there. Um, anyway, it's a single-player survival game with a drill ship. That's not bad. Um, it's quite good fun, actually. Uh, the, the the kind of the mandatory forced underground hiding sections, they are they're actually quite good fun. Um, it 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 breaks things up a little bit, particularly if you are overstretching yourself and try and go too far, and uh, and you kind of go, oh, I've left it a bit short, and the game is brutal in that it will kill you immediately should you be late to the party. Never be late to the party and always bring a bottle of wine. Um, anyway, I'll probably revisit this as it progresses. I'm whipping it. Uh, as it progresses through the early access cycle of joy. Uh, but, uh, but I quite enjoy it, and I've, I've sunk a few hours in, and uh, it's a bit of a giggle. Anyway, there you go. Right. It's not even an advert. That's not a review. No, 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 no. That's just my, that's, you know, that's just my take on things. It's not a review. It's not a review. I don't do reviews. Reviews are not what this channel is about. Turn the camera off.